Welcome to my channel, Light is a Feather Tarot. This is for the weekly reading for April 27th through May 3rd. Now, this isn't for any specific sign. This is just a general weekly reading for the collective. So first, I want to say thank you so much to all of my subscribers um, for participating in the last uh, contest. So the winner for the last week's weekly um, reading is Rising Phoenix 1111. So congratulations and thank you again for participating. I will uh, send you a message so you can receive your one question free reading. So this is the reading where we'll do this every single week until further notice. So listen out throughout this video for the hashtag and then I will pick a winner next week and you have the potential to win another free reading one question um, next week. So let's look at the energies for April 27th through May 3rd. So Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? So the first card that comes out is honesty. All right, I am fair and honest and attract fairness and honesty into my life. Hope that all of you guys are being safe and healthy. Spirit, what messages do we have for the weekly reading for the collective? Okay, so we're starting out with the unknown card. So there may be things that, that we're not aware of. There may be, you know, a little bit of uncertainty when it comes to Monday's energy. And then Tuesday's energy, we're starting off with the Six of Pentacles. So that speaks about, you know, generosity. It could be some type of give and take, creating some type of balance. Wednesday's energy, beautiful, Ace of Pentacles. So Wednesday energy is bringing in some brand new beginning, um, typically financial in nature, something very valuable, something that's gonna stand the test of time for the long run. Thursday's energy, we have the Nine of Pentacles. Beautiful. So, you know, Wednesday's energy really did bring in um, for Thursday some feeling of abundance. You know, this is this speaks about the Garden of Eden. It speaks of abundance. You know, this could be financially. This could be emotionally. You just feel very fulfilled. And then temperance so friday's energy is bringing in is is bringing in balance okay let me get one more card for saturday sunday energy nice and we're ending off with the queen of pentacles so for this week the overall energy is the Ace of Swords. So this speaks about some type of new beginning, some type of new clarity, um, some spark of inspiration. So let's see. So Spirit, can you please clarify Monday's energy? what is unknown to us this is very mysterious energy um you know maybe with the ace of swords coming up maybe you're looking for that clarity you're waiting for that new beginning that spark of inspiration that that moment of truth we have honesty here right maybe you're you're looking for that honest conversation you know either from another person or yourself and i feel like if you're waiting on anything on any type of answers or things are unclear with the seven of pentacles showing up this is saying that 
you know you have to be a little bit more patient to things that you're not privy to you know if you're asking yourself well, why this and why that and the lover's card fell out as well so for some of you guys um this could be in in regards to another person another person that you have a soul connection with this could be romantic this could be platonic it could be a friendship it could be a boyfriend girlfriend significant other um but i feel like you have to be patient with the unknown when it comes to this person um if that doesn't resonate then there you may have to make a choice about something and you don't necessarily have all of the answers maybe you're seeking that clarity or waiting for that clarity to come in and i truly feel like it's going to come in this week with the the overall energy being the ace of swords it's just a matter of when so can you clarify these six of pentacles beautiful the sun card so it's tuesday's energy i mean it's bringing in some type of balance you know maybe you're going to be receiving some type of generosity from somebody or or likewise maybe you are blessed yourself with different things and you're lending a helping hand to someone and it's really creating some type of restoring some type of balance this give and take either from this person or this choice that you make brings you happiness bring you joy brings you fulfillment Let's see, what about the Ace of Pentacles? Okay, so with this brand new beginning, you know, you have the Six of Swords. This is you moving forward, moving forward in the calmer waters. You know, this could be the way that you think. You know, you're, you're lightening the load. You're anything that doesn't serve you, you're moving away from that. You could physically be moving to this new beginning. This, all, this also shows, you know, any offers that you are given, any new beginnings, that you're going to take it. You're going to take it and you're going to move forward with that energy. Well, of fortune. So going back to Monday's energy of things being unknown and, and, and exercising patience. You know, this is letting me know for this new beginning, if you're waiting on this new beginning or any type of clarity, you know, divine timing is going to be a factor. So I always say it's it's spirit time, not your timing. Let's move these up a bit. Okay. So looking into Thursday's energy. We have the temperance card. So I feel that, you know, whatever this new beginning that comes in, you know, it's it's making you feel very fulfilled. You're feeling very secure. It's it's really restoring balance in your life. Spirit, please clarify the temperance card. I feel like with this new with this new balance coming in, it's really giving you some type of fresh look of way of looking at things, you know, maybe a very honest way of looking at things, looking at things from a different perspective. I'm almost getting the feeling that this is like almost very free, very liberating to be able to look at things in this manner, like almost with like a new 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 set of eyes i feel that you know maybe in the past or the beginning of the week you may have some type of anxieties when you know when you when things are unknown however with the temperance and the hangman card here i feel like any type of worries any type of stress any type of anything that you were losing sleep over i think you're kind of looking at it like why why was i even stressing over that like everything is fine Next, we have the Queen of Pentacles. You know, she's very secure. She's very grounded. She's, she looks at the details of things. So we have the Five of Pentacles. And let me get one more. 
see i feel like with the queen of pentacles and the five of pentacles being here i feel like this is your energy i feel like you're going to be very grounded um very stable you're you're going to be moving away from this energy of lack this energy of feeling left out in the cold i don't have enough right because you're going to have so much abundance and blessings around your life and you're going to have that new beginning it's coming in let me get one more card You know, and to get to this point in this new beginning and moving away from this lack, you know, you have to use your strength. You have to have faith in the universe, right? And there's no doubt about it. You're you're going to come out on top. <clears throat> so this speaks about a transition and an ending. And I feel that this transition, you know, it may or may not have been the easiest one, especially with the five of coins coming up here. But I feel like as the week progresses, you know, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, things are really going to turn around and you're going to see, um, you're, you're going to get that clarity that you need. And it's going to provide you with some type of um, confirmation or um, some type of comfort in knowing that you have the details and the answers that you were looking for. So very beautiful reading. So please leave a comment. If these messages resonated, please like, share, and subscribe. Again, the weekly winner this week is Rising Phoenix 1111. So the hashtag for this week i'm gonna go ahead and go with hashtag honesty so to enter in the contest for next week to be able to win a one question one free reading all you have to do is subscribe to my channel if you're not already like this video and comment hashtag honesty and that will enter you in for the contest for next week and i will announce the winner um, in the next weekly video. So again, thank you so much and till next time.